Hey guys, today in this video I'm going to talk about Christopher Nolan's style of filmmaking and story narration. Christopher Nolan has stood out as a unique filmmaker for the past decade with his ability to make blockbuster films which not only entertain but also made us think by using uncommon techniques that we wouldn't find in this generation. Boy, you are in for a show tonight, son. He has the ability to showcase to a mass audience while simultaneously using complex narratives in the movies creating a story that is complicated and leaving many unanswered questions in audiences minds when we look at two of his films we can always see that audience give the whole attention on the screen it's the way how he writes a story and narrates it in detail to the viewers he directs the stories in these films are complex and on the other hand it's easier to decode when we think about the methods he used to create them the first method he used is frame narrative which is also known as frame story a story tells another story in the story is called frame narrative complicated right for example inception the main character cobb is a professional thief who cons people by infiltrating their dreams In this movie, Cobb creates dreams within a dream to help Sato to get some valuable information from Robert Fisher. So in the story, every dream sequence is a differently established story and shown between each other. And in Prestige, the whole story is narrated as Bale's character read Angel's diary, which he wrote while reading Alfred's secret diary. So in the story, there were three established stories and shown between each other throughout the movie. The next one is he uses non-linear narrative. This technique is used to lay the film's resolution and the moment of realization of the film by mixing the way that the story is told thereby withholding information to the audience that could give away the ending of the film. For example, the first scene of Prestige. The film begins with Michael Caine showing a magic trick to Alfred's daughter at the very end of the film the same scene is shown as the conclusion for the story the final technique i like to talk about is cross cuts between characters and stories cross cuts between stories will keep the audience engaged to the film focusing on one important character throughout the entire film can a little bo- can a example in dark knight the joker and batman stories are shown in cross cut till both the characters meet Similarly in prestige both the magician's life is shown in the same technique after they split up from the theater even in interstellar and insomnia he used the same technique this is a pivotal point and work for the films with a lot of tension and action <laughs>